According to monitor.co.ug, pornography has been escalating sexual violence in Lyra schools, according to members of parliament sitting on the select committee investigating allegations of sexual violence in schools and institutions of learning. So they have heard that access and exposure to pornographic materials to students in Lyra school district has escalated the levels of sexual harassment and violence amongst girls and boys in school. According to one of the woman senior teachers at the Central Lyra Central Primary School, Lyra Central Primary School, she said that Quote, I have interacted with two students whose performance was deteriorating, but I was shocked when they confessed that they had been watching pornographic movies and they feel so addicted to the movies, which was affecting their concentration in class. The woman further blamed the laxity of parents who have either brought home pornographic movies or failed to monitor what their children watch. She said, she also said, I have witnessed a mother watching pornography with her daughters, and when I intervened, their mother simply asked me to mind my own business because we are living in the modern world. <laughs> That's insane. That The end of that, that response from the mother is completely insane. And another quote I want to talk about is, Lucas South member, Members of Parliament, Mr. Stephen Kisa, had the following to say. He said, Parents should stop leaving their mobile phones with children because this is a serious danger. A child should not access a parent's phone, and a parent should not buy a phone for a young child. This will help check and protect kids from accessing uncalled information on mobile phones and the internet. So, I'm just going to talk about the the second quote here with the teacher intervening with the mother who was watching pornography with the, with, with their daughters that's completely insane that something like that was actually caught you know not to mention her res the mother's response was to mind the teacher's own business because quote we are living in the modern world that does not you can't use that as an excuse just because we're living in the modern world doesn't mean that everything is okay you know or everything has no concept no negative consequences that's that's the problem with that statement and I've well, the modern world has definitely brought us problems okay so the internet has brought us all kinds of things great things I would never say that the internet is a bad thing I mean you know with more responsibilities with, or with more power comes more responsibilities. That's, you know, that's a common quote. And I strongly believe that, you know, the internet, when you access it, you are accessing all kinds of information, but you have to be responsible with it on an individual basis. Otherwise, you could very well get caught in the, the uh, pornographic trap, as I call it. So, and then back to what Mr. Stephen Kisa said, Parents should definitely stop leaving their mobile phones with children who are what I would call too young to maybe be responsible with the phone, you know, and understand what kind of content is on there. And I'm not, I would never devalue or say that a child is less intelligent than anyone else. That's completely false. I'm just saying that children need to develop the understanding that, that not everything on the internet is okay first and foremost and that starts with the parents guidance with parents is extremely important I've been guided on certain things in my life and they have very well helped me out however at the time I was growing up with you know I was growing up with dial-up internet and all kind you know that kind of thing I, I didn't have the research or I didn't have the the guidance on pornography which I would never blame anyone for but you know in today's age it's definitely very important in my opinion to get that information across to the children and and to to protect them and and I, I definitely would strongly consider before getting a child a phone you know if that is the right thing for them in their in, their, in that time in their life is it really 
is it necessary? I can understand, you know, having to call parents and whatnot in emergencies. That's great. Maybe limiting the uh, limiting the amount of data or completely removing the ability to use data would be maybe a possibility in in for parents in that situation. And so I think that you know I also felt a lack of conf lack of focus in anything when I was addicted to porn when I was watching it a ton I I completely can relate to the students who were having performance issues in the classroom because pornography can completely warp your mind you you just at least for me I felt like a different person I felt that that was just all I needed I I just wanted I just wanted it I always wanted my fix so I'm not surprised by this and definitely definitely teachers and parents should keep a strong eye on what kind of material is accessible in schools not only at home too so at home it's very important to 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 monitor that you know and, and not even on phones but on computers as well it's also important to have some sort of monitor so that you can help guide these children on the right path so that they don't ever have to deal with porn